Hi, I'm Charlie Toprek and I'm still here in our headquarters in Nuremberg, Germany to meet a couple of our commercial guys, Ron and Thomas. Hi there. Hi there. To find out a little bit more about the collaboration between commercial and tech on our new product range. So maybe um, guys, you could start by introducing yourselves individually and maybe telling us a little bit about your role within the commercial team. My main responsibility is the um, post analytics. So we are making further deep into analytics based on the POS data we observe at the point of sale, obviously our main um, focus. And uh, this will be more and more in involved into automated processes in the near future. That's why we get involved with our tech colleagues more and more. And in the, in the future, we will have half and full automatized processes doing the stuff we actually do now and offering to the clients right now, but uh, more advanced in the future. Okay, my name is Thomas. I'm working in the same team as Ron does. Uh, we're connecting the dogs between the POS guys, the SAS guys, the clients. So we make things work and try to support everyone in having a great time and learning a lot from our products. Good stuff. Well, I understand that our product range, our product offering is evolving and changing, but compared to where it was maybe two years ago, it's a completely set, new set of products that we're going to be selling to our clients. How has that change been for you guys? Very exciting. So. I've been more or less from scratch on a part of this uh, this new product, uh, Pause Analytics, and uh, it's a huge responsibility, but it's super exciting as well. So if you get to, to do something that is hasn't been done before, and uh, you get a lot of uh, in, input from from your own perspective, from your personal side, and get to to get uh, point of views from from colleagues as well, from from technical, but other from from sales, as Thomas has mentioned, and experienced colleagues obviously as well needed to to need to get involved. So uh, it's very exciting and it's fun um, and you get to, to, to do stuff that hasn't been done before and get your personal, get personally involved into, into the product. To me it's a totally new world as well because I haven't been doing all the PRS related stuff and all the sale of uh, stuff uh, before so it's learning every day and it's still evolving because we definitely will have new products which will make things easier for me but also for the client which is the most important thing. Um, well, I'm, I'm trying to stay ahead of the line and push the, the new products also with the clients because they're excited that there is change, obviously, because some things tend to be slow or not up to date, so we, we're trying to, to fix that. Wow, so have they been quite receptive then towards our new um, product offering that's going to come to market, the clients? Well, for, for the legacy products, we told, it, told them about the new developments, that there will be improvements and there will be inclusion of POS data by default and so on. And this was a welcomed a lot. And, and basically, a finally, GFK will do that is, is the main theme here from the client side. And also our POS colleagues or our sales guys, they are excited to sell that because uh, it makes their job easier. Mm -hmm. I guess they like the new approach. So um, we are now trying to solve a problem as, as a complete. So beyond a simple data provision where, where the client wasn't on its own solving an, a problem, solving an issue, we now can evolve other products, have new products in, in the launch that helps the client to really get a deep understanding and um, more or less see, see uh, the cooperation with, with the client as a, as a real partnership which not necessarily was the case in the past, um, where we were perceived as a, as a data provider, more or less. Now uh, we have uh, solutions, technical solutions as well, that help the client and us um, to really solve the problem together. Sounds really client-centric, to be honest, and client-focused. That's the idea. I, <laughs> so I'm just thinking here that you guys, um, I know you've been involved with POS almost from the outset since the new kind of product range has been created and yourself has been here working on more of our legacy offerings. I imagine that there was maybe some fear within the business when we were told we're going to completely change GFK, we're going to create new products, you're going to have to re-educate yourself on this and you're going to work with brand new colleagues who do things that you've probably never heard of before. How has that relationship been between commercial and tech regarding you know, delivering these new solutions? Well, that's the easy part, uh, because everyone's quite helpful and, and they're open to, to changes and also to suggestions and they help me if I have a question, so that's easy. The, the hard thing was at first to get to know each other, because 
one person sits here, the other in the other building, next one in another uh, country. The first thing that was important was to get to know each other and that once that happened everything went quite smoothly. This has got much better in the past as well so and I, I assume it will be even get better with a new campus um, that we will get into exchange much much easier and I've been now in, in touch with colleagues I've never thought I would ever be as uh, the developer of, of our new uh, solutions of our new ecosystem and we just recently had an exchange which was uh, very useful for both sides as we we got perspective from from a client side so my input from their side but on the other end what was necessary for the development which questions do you need they have to answer at all or either um, the, the direction is, is correct and necessary or if we should adjust the approach a little. So am I correct in thinking that we're not taking the approach of going to our engineers and going, our client wants this, you must do this. It sounds like a little bit more flexible where you're going to the engineers, you're saying, we want this, what can you do? And then finding something in the middle, is that correct? or? Somewhat like this, yeah. So, so obviously the, the development has to, to be from scratch on and the, the developers have to, to have an idea and get to with a, a structure um, to us and, and we, we try to, to um, get insights from, from our own house or inside experience and to use that to, to make adaptions to the structure that has been established and to tune in before we approaching the, before approaching the client. So. Um, take the experience we have in-house and to improve the, the product um, and this is an ongoing exchange. So there's a first version uh, provided by the development, we make adjustments and the second version we make adjustments. So there's an ongoing discussion which is very interesting. Yeah, but, but it's uh, more and more also in the, in the client facing side already where the client first lead clients get uh, their feedback in so we have uh, a better view on their perspective on the new products. Yeah. So it's almost client sales and engineering all working together, yeah. all sharing ideas. Which is really great because everyone has a different perspective and obviously at the end the client has to be content with our offering. So that's uh, something that we had to improve on and I think we did a lot. Yeah. But oftentimes clients do not even know what they actually want to know. So um, you have to you have to provide them with an idea um, they weren't aware of. So um, that's an interesting part that we get in touch with colleagues who have the market expertise, um, with the developers who may come from from other companies and and have bring in their input, which we with our GFK um, glasses haven't thought about maybe. And that's very interesting and um, helps uh, to, to enrich the product. Nice, it, it all sounds really collaborative, really positive. Where do you see GFK in two years? A good question. <laughs> Back on track being uh, a market leader in our uh -huh. business. Yeah, as mentioned, um, we are going beyond data providing. In a co-development with the client, as you have mentioned, as a, from a more consulting perspective, providing real insights, real enriched answers uh, to the clients, getting ideas, workshops whatsoever, together with the clients, uh, enriching our products. And this is an ongoing process, which was not, will not be completed in two years, to be honest. But I think we will be a, a, a great step further in that direction. Forgive me for re-asking, how long did each of you say you'd been with GFK? Well, I'm, I'm, I'm the oldest guy. I'm with, in GFK like 20 years now. Wow, okay. And yourself? Uh, I myself, I'm three years now. What, what I'd like to ask yourselves, and, I, and I'll start with yourself, um, from when you started with GFK 10 years ago to where GFK now is now with kind of our new modern working practices, what, what changes have you noticed? Well, big changes, obviously, because by then it was uh, 25 silos. Everyone was doing their stuff and not looking over the uh, over the edge and, and just doing their stuff and being different companies by law also so that makes things uh, even hard to cooperate from department to department let alone from company to company so there was basically no transparency and, and now it's everyday work I, I work with the several divisions almost every week so that's not a problem anymore and everyone has changed their attitude towards that so that's a great step forward Brilliant. And um, what about yourself from three years ago till today? A similar story or a little bit different? Yeah, it's uh, it got faster than expected. So um, first yeah, of all, I, at the at the end, it got a lot faster. In yeah, the beginning, it was a very moderate change, yeah. and now it's, it's 
taking up yeah, speed. I, I can say that um, it's pretty much as Thomas described. When when I started here, there was I was part of the POS business, core business, without much ex exchange beyond that. Um, after the many measurements and initiatives, there have been. Um, a lot of changes in that day-to-day business. So uh, we got involved with other solutions, enriched our insights um, of the current solutions, uh, got in exchange with um, marketing. We, we tried really to, to get a complete view on the market, a, a better understanding um, beyond what, what was already aware in this department. Oh, it got much faster in the last two years, yeah. Look, really great to get uh, insight into how you're now collaborating with the different departments, the reception from our clients towards our new product range. And to be honest, it sounds like you guys are just enjoying the new GFK a lot more than, let's say, 10 years ago when it was less agile, let's say. So I think that's all that's left to say is thank you very much. Thank you. And until next time, take care. Thank you for watching. If you'd like to find out more about GFK or join one of our global teams, please check out the GFK website and our social media channels. See you in the next video.